couple good things, and then um, but it was just like we practiced all week. Very lackluster effort, I thought overall. Um, we turned the ball over down here on the goal line that really changed the complexion of the game. And um, you know, I just again we step up a level. That is what it is. I mean, they're you know, I mean they're supposed to be a better team than us. I mean that's the reason they play at a different level, a ball more scholarships. But I. I just don't think we executed very good um, all the way across the board. I thought that our special teams played well for the night. I, that was a big concern of mine coming into the game. Um, but all in all, it just it was a lackluster day for the racers. A little bit about Miller. He gets down here. You're going for the first down, and he gets the first down, but maybe a little bit more. And their defense just pulled the ball out. Yeah, well, we holding the ball a little too loose and trying to get it over the goal line, and their defender made a great play. And um, you think about it, they ended up going 99 yards after that to, to go up um, 13 to nothing whereas all of a sudden we had a chance to go in at seven to six and so um, that was a huge momentum swing and um, you know and then that was a long drive and then we gave up that long drive at the end of the half um, you know we were actually going in to score and we shot ourselves in the foot and um, just had way too many penalties um, offensively. Every time we got something going, we just we would shoot ourselves in the foot by doing something um, that we normally don't do. We talked about this team being similar to Missouri, maybe even a little bit better. Boy, from up in the press box, they looked awful big down there along that line. Well, they were. I, I don't know, you know, playing both of their quite SEC yet, but um, old Dave Clawson's a great coach, and um, he, he does a fabulous job. He's built this program back up, and um, you know, with defensive line, we wore out there at the, in the, at the end. I mean, we um, part of it was our own fault because we gave up those long drives, and then um, offensively, you know, we just we couldn't sustain it um, like like we needed to. So. Um, but again, when you go back and watch the tape, I'm sure there's a lot more positives. Um, you know, these games, like I said, they, they are very difficult to prepare for because of the level of competition. I just didn't think we executed like we were capable of executing. Travel have anything to do with it? Because I know you got in late last night uh, with everything, and this game time kind of changed from we thought it was going to be a late game to then mid-afternoon. No, that didn't have anything to do with it. It is what it is, and racer time is where we go by. That, well, that's right, and um, I mean we just didn't play well, and um, and again it, it all started during the week. We had, like I said, we had a lackluster week, and there's an old Chinese saying, "As ye practice, ye shall play," and and we played like we um, practiced this week, and I think that's what's um, that's what's disappointing. Then you say, "Well, why'd you?" Why don't you change it during the week? Sometimes you can't change it, and um, we were just hoping we'd come out a little bit more focused. But um, you know, those games are over with now, and um, you know we usually don't talk about the next one, but we start conference play next week, and um, maybe we'll um, we will make some corrections that we need to make in order to be ready to go. You know, it's kind of hard to judge where our team's at. Um, two 1A games, played an NAIA team, and then we played a really good Missouri State team and, and did some good things there. So um, next week will kind of be the telltale sign. Well, two and two, and like you say, next week really gets us started for the OVC and uh, go down to Jacksonville State. Well, yep, and you know, I told the guys after the game, I mean, headed into the season, you know, I thought that um, if we ended up being three and two at the end of September, that would put us in good position to reach our goals. And um, we're two and two. Um, next week is the um, the rubber match, the rubber game, and um, we'll see how it plays out. Coach, good luck to you next week and have safe travels. Thank you, Paul.